Welcome back to the Ratchet Clank 100% walkthrough on the PlayStation 3. This is part 26, and in this part we're going to the robot plant on Planet Court. So welcome back to Planet Core 2. This is the second time that we are here. And uh, this time we're going to go to through the actual robot plant. So we're going to go into the headquarters using the hollow guys. That's why we went to Claypool 3 to get the hollow guys. So we can use it on this planet for the second time. We are here. And Firstly, I have to start off by saying that you have to excuse me because, um, yeah, I've, I haven't been, like, home lately. I've been, like, with other families celebrating Christmas, but that's not what I have to excuse about. But, um, today I got sick, so I'm still sick right now. It, I'm just, like, sore in my throat and I've got a headache. But... Mm, so if I cough through this video, then you, then you know why. I will try to cough like in the cutscene, so I will cut out like the sound and the sound that I make in the cutscene, so you won't hear my coughing. So yeah, I'm sick, so that's why I'm not talking like I usually do because now I sound like I don't know a whale or something. I sound quite weird. And I have an excuse if there are some background noises. It's just that I'm home now. So my parents are in the house. Obviously, so yeah, they may, might make some noise as well. So have to excuse me about that. But yeah, whatever. Now I I don't really remember if I've gone through like uh how many gold balls and skill points and stuff there are in this planet. So I'm just going to do it right now. Even if I have done it before, but um, there are zero skill points on this planet, but there are actually two gold bolts. And the first gold bolt we are going to get in this part, and the next and the second one we're going to get when we come back here to Plan Quarty for the third and last time. If you don't count challenge mode, but I'm not going to come here for challenge mode. But I'm not going to talk about that right now. Uh, so, yes. But, yeah. Um, what you do in this planet is basically sneaking past these robots. And to do that, you have to use the Holo Guys. Because, obviously, the Holo Guys transforms you, transform you to a robot. You're not, obviously, a robot. Like, like you are a robot. But it kind of transforms you to a, transform you to a robot for, like that time and it can't get out of it obviously so when you you have the other guys on when you come to these walls kind of laser walls you want to wave at the robots because they will let you through but if you get out of the other guys or you attack the robots they will start attacking you but first they will go to a red button that is located around every robot you can see it right there to the right, left they will press that and when they press that um some rocket oh, some uh, machines will start shooting at you so you don't want that because the machines will stay out quite a bit and they even even though how what was I supposed to say I can't talk today so I'm really sorry about that but they will hunt you down and even if you jump and do all crazy stuff they will still hit you so don't really try to uh, get away from them i do but that's because i just want to and you can't do it if you want to obviously but it won't help you obviously because i keep saying obviously a lot but yeah it won't help you so I'm just going to let you know that. A good thing to use on this planet is the Devastator because they can shoot from far distances. They can shoot down robots when you are not close to them at all. So that's what I use. So 
Um, you might find this plan quite hard, but I don't because I got like I got the Devastator. But if I didn't have the Devastator, Devastator, I would I would use the Visa Bomb. But if you don't have any of those weapons, you might find it hard. But I would just suggest to every door, like this door that you go through, get on your Hollow Dice. Unless you know that there's no other robots on the other side, then you don't have to put them on. But I would I would recommend putting the whole guys on so that you're safe. Um, but this part isn't going to be that long. It's actually going to be quite a short part. You can probably already see on the length of the video that it's not very that it's not a very long video. It's quite a short video. But it's sweet and short, as I say. So, yeah. But, if you go through these doors, you will see robots being made. These are not like the robots that show around this planet and try to take you out. But these are bigger robots and batter robots. I know the batters. I know batter is a word, but it's like... Not in the way that I'm saying it. But whatever. So that is something pretty cool, in my opinion. And you have to use your thruster pack here, though. So if you use your other pack, then you have to get out your thruster pack. And I really like the thruster pack, as all of you already know, but... Yeah, it's just better, in my opinion. But this is actually the last room that we're going to go into before we get a cutscene. Cutscene is in another room on the left so we'll go into that after we get take out this robot and get the books you can see inside there you might recognize that room actually but enough talking we'll just go into the cutscene that should do it mom oh brother i tried mom I know. Hey, look! A sister! My fellow blog, our synthetic world is now fully functional and ready for habitation. However, there is one small obstacle in our way. This pathetic lump of a planet. Due to some blunder of fate, it happens to occupy the galaxy's most perfect orbit. But no more. Behold, the Deplanetizer, the most powerful laser ever created. Soon, we'll move the Deplanetizer into place just above the planet's surface. I will, of course, be on hand to press the button that will blow this mud ball to smithereens. No one will even miss it. See you then. Ratchet, are you all right? He is going to pay excuse me it shouldn't have taken me this long to see it drek is going to find out what happens when you mess with my home what are you smiling at this is the ratchet i always knew was there okay if we're gonna do this we need to get on the drek ship and then we can find out where he set up that laser i will try to make you proud mom Oh, that is so sweet. So from that cutscene, we now know that Drek is going to use a huge laser to take our belt in because he says it's in the way, but it's not really. It's just to piss off Ratchet, obviously. But if you use your um, swing shot to get up there, you will get the first gold bolt on this planet. So there's one more gold bolt to get. So in the next part, we're going to try and infiltrate um, Drek's so in the next part, we are going to go to Drex Fleet, the Valden Orbit. So I guess I will see you on Drex Fleet, the Valden Orbit for part 27. See you there.